Good morning, everybody. Or good afternoon, good evening, whenever you watch this. <laughs> Welcome back. I'm Steph, and this is Steph's Little Farm. So, yeah, it's a, it's a beautiful day today. Yesterday was fabulous here. It was only like 80, what did it get, 84? Oh, that was just amazing. It was great. It was great. Yeah. I was, yeah. So I went down and I checked out to see if the uh, salmon thing had been open yet. If maybe they opened it early. And no, they didn't. So it is scheduled for the 13th still till tomorrow, Friday. And so, uh, yeah, I'll definitely make sure. I, I, I'm, I'm going to go down Friday because I don't want to go down Saturday because it's going to be too crazy. But I will go down Friday to see how it's going at first. And then probably go down back Monday too. Um, if it's not, if the fish aren't flowing that much. Yesterday... I have a few videos. I mean, I, I, I took and stuff. I'll show you guys. It just wasn't as, as exciting the day before that what, last time I did. There was a lot more fish, I thought, jumping and stuff. But they were there. You could see them. Uh, yeah, there was a lady you'll see in the video. She had uh, one of those cameras, a GoPro in the water filming. It was really co cool. I told her, I said, boy, you're going to have some cool stuff. So let me show you who's out. That's Henny Penny and Theo. Theo's, Henny's in eating all of uh, Sophie's food. Theo's checking it out. And where is Sophie? Of course, she's over by the little man and his girls. So, yeah, they're all doing good. Yeah. Let me show you. Oh, let's check on the babies real fast. Hey, babes. Her mama's run come running right up. We want to see the babies, not you guys. Back up. Back up, mama. Can we see the babies? I want to show them how big they're getting. They're still itty bitty. See, they're still itty bitty. They're the itty bitty babies. They're the itty bitty babies, but they're awful cute. You guys, it's got your water already dirty, and I had already cleaned it this morning. You little monsters. Mamas just can't stop scratching. But they're cute, aren't they? Just too cute. Yeah. I mean, you can't give what you watch enough of baby chicks. I really believe that. Oh, I got to sing her here. Let me go see her. You want to sing for me this morning, huh? No, you want me to open up that door so you can get up there, huh? I know you don't like laying in that nest, huh? I'm sorry. Yeah, let me show you. There's the man. Hello, little man, little man, little man. What are you doing, little man, little man, little man? Are you doing good today, little man? Watch this, guys. Watch, 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 watch. When I put my foot there. I was just just. <laughs> He's a nut. He hates my foot. He just, oh, he just, if he could get me, he would. I tell you, he's so bad. And there's the girls. Yes. I don't know if you guys saw my last video or not, but yeah, where I called uh, the three babies in here, they're now known as the monsters. Yes, and I did not let them out yesterday. Um, Pearl and Sylvia got out for a few minutes with me, and then I was able to get them up. But the monsters... Until I can, you know, have plenty of time to spend down here to make sure I can get them up. That's what I'm going to do. But uh, they lost their privilege of getting out first in the morning right now. Because they're just, these two, they'll be fine. But those, no, they don't, they just won't listen. They go in and as soon as I turn my back, like I said, out they come like maniacs. And Pearl does cause a lot of trouble that way. But she always goes back in for me, so, Yeah. Okay, guys, so tomorrow's uh, Friday the 13th. And I was wondering, uh, you know, are you guys suspicious? You know, do you have superstitions, I mean, of like Friday the 13th and stuff like that, you know, different ones and stuff. You know, like, you know, black crap crosses your path and stuff. You know, super stupid, stupid little superstitions that you have and stuff that you do. Like, I remember always... My grandmother, uh, my grandma Wood, she used to always, when we'd be walking together and you'd be walking side by side somebody, and you know there'd be like a pillar there or something, one walks on one side, one walks on the other side. So something comes between you guys. She always used to say bread and butter. So now I've caught myself ever since I was, oh God, probably about 16, I always say it. It's just one of those things. Whenever I'm walking with somebody and something comes in between, bread and butter. <laughs> just even with the animals, I do it. It's just really funny. Yeah. And then another one was when you were a little kid, you know, you always used to say, don't step on the crack. 
you break your mother's back. I, I can remember being about, what was it, probably about eight years old and just thinking, you know, God, don't step on, don't, don't, don't step on the cracks. Just don't step on the cracks. I, I was really worried that I'd break my mom's back. <laughs> then I got mad her one day. I'll never forget it. <laughs> my, one of my sisters who got mad out there was stepping on the crack and breaking her mother's back. <laughs> and it didn't work. So we were like, oh, well, that didn't work. <laughs> but yeah, that was one. But there's so many of them. So yeah, you know, if I think more today, I'll bring them up and stuff. And, crazy little things or you know there's things that you, rituals that you do every day that you have to do you when you get up in the morning or whatever or it's stuff oh here's a good one we used to go and play bingo at the bingo hall baller my cousin and some of her friends and stuff and we'd go and we go sit down you know none of us knew what we were doing we'd go buy our dollars because we always lost them you know and we'd buy our dollars and stuff well have you ever, guys, if you've never been to a bingo hall parlor, you got to go. It's it's amazing. The people are. Well, the ladies that go all the time and the guys, they have their little stands. They set it up where they got the thing so their bingo, bingo cards, you know, slanted up so they can dab their thing. They have all their colors set up. But then the trinkets, they set up their little trinkets all over the place. They're good luck charms, you know, all over. And they have to be just in the right place. <laughs> I remember just laughing you know looking at it all like what the heck i'll never forget one of our friends she, <laughs> they had some cute little ones up there on top of their thing or whatever she went over and she goes oh she picked it up and she goes this is adorable this is the cutest thing and the lady gave her a look like she was gonna stab her through her eyeballs <laughs> so when she went to put it back she didn't put it back right <laughs> The lady, as soon as she walked away, the lady went over, grabbed it, and wiped it all off and made sure she put it back perfect on the spot. <laughs> I remember that was the funniest darn thing. Yeah, so that was really good. So, yeah, there's crazy things. And then, like, up here, you know, we have the casinos and stuff. And we'll go, you know, I, I, I used to go and have lunch, lunch there or dinner there once a week or whatever. And I'd go out a little bit and gamble a little bit and stuff. And watching some of the people, I mean, like, you'd see, even though it's a push the button now, there's no more quarters or anything, she still would act like she was doing the change. She'd tap the screen, tap the thing, and then push the button. Tap, tap, tap. <laughs> and then when the sign would come up for the bonus, she would rub the screen and sit there. <laughs> the crazy things people do. It, it, it's quite I, I love it to be honest with you but yeah so anyways let's get started with the day like i said if i think of any others i'll definitely bring them up but definitely you guys if you have any please leave them in the comment i love i will love reading them and i'm sure everybody else will too and so i mean good fun you know let's have some fun all right let me shut this off honey what are you doing what are you doing honey Right, well, let's let the crazies out. It's like I said, I'll probably let Pearl and Sylvia out a little later by themselves so I can keep an eye on them. Sorry about the cans, you probably won't get to see very much, but still. Different view, different view. Come on, girls. Come on, boys. Come on out. Come on out. It's okay. They're out. Yeah, they're out. Right away. Right away under the pigeon coop. Can you guys see that? Right away. It's like, how do I, I mean, they're so naughty. You guys are so naughty. You know you're not supposed to be under there. Come on, girls. Let's go. Everybody move. Come on, move out from under there. So Sophie's over there. She found something she's eaten. Theo, she took off. She doesn't want any part of it. This one's coming over here to give her problems. Yeah. And it's, yeah. Theo, come here. Look at her run. Yeah, she, it, you know, it's a chicken. It can't help itself, but it does defend itself. But like I said, the bravest of them all is this thing. What are you doing over here? Are you going to cause trouble? Is that what it is? Go away. Leave her alone. Here's Theo. Theo, you're okay, baby. You're okay, Theo. Look at them. They're just naughty. Oh, I have one in my egg, I think. You can see it right up there. Yeah, you just stay on your post. When I go in to clean, you can come in with me, okay? All right. Oh, 
the boys are here. Hello, boys. Bello, 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 bello. <gasps> Pippi, good morning, Miss Pippi. You were just giving me kisses and loves this morning, huh? But I didn't have my camera. Uh, yeah, she was a love bug this morning. But yeah, we'll go out there with them for a little bit. Guys, the other thing too, I got some vi some pictures of Doolittle, <laughs> the little kid that took him to, and he took him to the his county fair or whatever, and he won first place. So I think it was with showmanship, but still. How exciting, huh? And they said, yeah, Bella was the hit. I mean, Dolittle was the hit down there. Uh, even the grown-ups, he went in the adult uh, showmanship, too. <laughs> that was so exciting. So, yeah, I'll put pictures on here before the end. Yeah. That one down there, I just looked over, and she was going like a mad woman. I don't, it's like she's afraid of the little birds, or I don't know what's going on. She was like crazy, going around in a circle like a nut. And I know it's... This is so Sophie's over next to me. So see, look at her. <laughs> she's, lost, she's lost her mind. She's scared of the little birds. Oh God. Uh, that is some funny stuff. Uh, a little sparrow scared her. <laughs> That's some funny, funny stuff. Now she won't do it anymore. But anyways, that was funny. Come running. Hi! <laughs> Hello. Yeah, I'm out here to give you some loves, huh? You want to give me some loves today, huh? Hi, Bello. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> there you guys are, huh? See, I can't get you on the camera, huh? I'm trying. There we go. Can you see them? <laughs> Let me sit down. Well, they do get up a little close and personal, so it's kind of hard to... Because like I said, if I sit this down, the boys knock it over instantly. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see that. Do you see what he's doing to me? Those horns. Uh, Pippi's going potty. Bello, what's underneath? What you checking out underneath? Uh, Pippi, but she's... Yeah, oh, sorry. She's going potty. I, I swear she potties like a river. You come and give me some kisses? Huh? Yeah, you want to give the camera a kiss? Yeah, give the camera a kiss. Uh, say hi. <laughs> These two... He just wants to have his head on my leg and me rub his horn. Rub right back here behind his horns. And Pip just wants some love, huh? You want some love, huh? <laughs> Give me a kiss. <laughs> Bella, what's up? Why is your head under the thing? Get your head out. Donk that horn. The problem is, is now his horns are starting to turn. Ow! His horns are starting to turn. So, yeah, now he really gets me. And it's like... Yeah, I have to really be careful. Oh, here's Pip. Hi, Pippers. Hi, Pippers. You want to give me a kiss? Mm, I love you. I do. Mommy loves you. I don't know if you guys could see that or not. It's kind of hard. Huh. It's kind of hard. It's kind of hard. You don't... Yeah, Pip. Oh, gosh. You just love me so much, huh? I love you, too. I do. I love you, Pippy. It's going to be hard. Hi when you go away, huh? And there's old Tonk sitting over there. He's mad at me because I didn't give him enough love. Yeah. And Bello, I don't know what his problem is today. This guy's head underneath. Why has your son got his head underneath? Bello, come on up. <laughs> okay, Pip. Let me shut this hey, off for a second. Bello. Hi, Bello. Hi. <laughs> oh, my baby boy. Huh? I know, Pip. I love you, too. You got alpha, alfalfa breath. You have alfalfa breath. Yes, you do. They're cute though, aren't they? And oh, there, see, he's getting his, gotta get his loving. Gotta get his, oh yeah, that's what he loves. Huh, that's what my boy loves, huh? Oh yeah, that's what he loves. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna stop this. So, I'm in with the, pig, the girl pigeons, the hens. And so, but there's the first one up there that graduated. There she is. Like I said, I can tell her because she's got the, her eyes still bigger, uh, big and black, sorry. I feel I was looking at it, something when I turned it. And then there's one of the other graduates. Isn't, oh, and there she's showing off her wings. Oh, look at the pretty colors on her. She is just really, really pretty. She's going to be a pretty bird. You are, you're going to be a pretty bird. 
pretty, 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 pretty. Look how dirty they can make their cage. I mean, that's crazy. And then these are the other two babies. They're still on the ground. The one still has a lot of baby, baby hairs and stuff, but she's e he's eating and drinking there by herself. I believe that other black one, I believe it's going to be a female, it looks like. Yeah. But not positive. But yeah, that, that one's going to be really pretty too. They're just pretty little birds. Yeah. And then, oh my god, there's the yellow. Good look at her. She's really a pretty bird, huh? Pretty color. And then you got the red one up there. So what he was thinking about next is because, you know, it's like we really don't have anything... <sighs> You know, we don't really, I mean, we've, we've tried to sell them and stuff like that, but it's really hard to be honest with you up here to sell them and stuff like that. So what my dad calls them is he calls them the Millers, the Miller birds after him and cause he's mixed so many, but he's thinking about doing this one here with, he's got, I think he said a red bar or something like that and bring her with that to see what colors we get. Because we might get the ones with the bars on them and stuff. There's none in here to show you what they look like. But yeah. Pretty, pretty cool. And that one up there. She's really pretty too. She's that splash with the, uh, with the yellow. Or you can call it red, I guess. I'm not sure. <laughs> this little one. She's just, she's going to be such a pretty little bird. Pretty that's it if it's a female i don't know yet he just puts them in here with them that way the cocks don't beat them up so guys once again these are the cocks in the back all the males in the back the bell pigeons so these are some of the colors i'm talking about so see that gray one there right there that's walking kind of a grayish lavender that's the bars on the wings that i was talking about just so you guys could see that yeah just thought hey i need to show them these guys Aren't they beautiful colors? Really beautiful colors. All right, guys. It's been a good day. Good day. Been fun. So, if you guys had any, you know, like I said, make sure if you have any superstitions or anything like that, or little nuances that you do and stuff. But I did think of some more. Knock on wood. Salt spills. You know, tomorrow, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go out and check on the fish and stuff, but I probably won't put that one out till Saturday. But I think tomorrow, watch tomorrow's video. I might have there. I'm going to talk more about the superstitions and stuff. I think it'll be interesting. I was looking up some stuff and how the orange and origins of them and stuff could be really interesting so you guys give me that thumbs up like subscribe share comment definitely comment about them guys i hope i put the smile on your face today hopefully put you grit made you laugh a little bit but definitely put that warmth in your heart you guys have a nice day